Well, we are out in Tryon Creek State Park, a spot near and dear to my heart. I know this park quite well, and we're doing trail maintenance. We got some serious tools, I guess, hence the, the hard hats. Uh, and I've even got a little ax kind of thing, but we're on one of the side trails where vegetation has grown in, and we're, we're basically doing some construction work and uh, trying to help a collective resource. A lot of hikers use this area, it's gorgeous. And we're doing our part though in a broader sense for the greater Portland community. And the thorns and timbers now, have been doing this thing for years. This is a very much a cornerstone uh, week for us. And every team in every sport talks about community service. I believe the thorns and the timbers do it as well as anybody. Nobody gets more volunteers together, more projects impacted. We do a lot financially. We put our money, our time, our effort where our mouth is in a way that, that very few pro sports teams do. Uh, I'm sorry, go ahead. Ethaniel, um, at the time you guys have been doing this, uh, why was it so important for you guys to start this initiative to begin with and why you as the owner wanted to make sure the organization is kept with it? Well, I mean, look, we, we were always uh, very, very committed to community service. The concept of Stand Together Week was actually something that I'll give Mike Golub credit for. I mean, he thought, what can we do that sort of, you know, that nobody has done? We, we you know, we've got this volunteer ethos. The Army um, already did a lot of volunteerism, which was unique to supporters groups. Um, and so we thought, let's do something bigger. Let's do a week long, you know, work with, with city leaders, work with volunteers, work with all our players, uh, with, with, with all the teams. And my first question was, can we pull it off? Uh, you know, if we're gonna do something, we gotta do it well. And not only have we pulled it off, we've grown it every year. Uh, and it's, it's become very much uh, one of the events, the seminal, they're one of the, the key events that everybody looks forward to. I saw the pictures of Gio making lasagna the other day. Um, we've got uh, some Thorns players, a, a goalkeeper tandem for the uh, for the team uh, here right now with Britt and Bella, the Killer Bees, uh, and Jack and Nat are here. Anyway, it's awesome. And then you were at the All Star Game earlier this week, so you've had already a tough travel week. Why was it so important for you to make sure you had an event that you could come back at and help out with the community? Everybody does it. So, and and I'm no no bigger or you know more important than anybody else and in fact i've probably done more uh manual labor most people would find that hard to believe than than many of the people out here i mean that was my family grew up um on a bigger farm uh and and i was working uh all the way through my college years and work construction jobs and uh so you know this is stuff that i'm that i'm used to